Day one, just checking into the hotel. 25. Yeah. We just finished getting all our gear, got all the cool swag, new sweaters, jackets, a little bit of everything. Well, today, day one, we got to meet a lot of the campers. We got to meet some of the people with the foundation, which was great. Welcome to the 2017 Mario Lemieux Fantasy Hockey Camp. And as you know, proceeds from camp benefit the Mario Lemieux Foundation's cancer projects, as well as our Austin's Playroom Project, where we build playrooms and medical facilities. There's a, quite a little fraternity that's developed. There are fast friends here. There's guys that maybe they only see each other a couple times a year. And then you have other guys that sound like they stay in contact all year long. You know, like some people take fishing trips or go hunting together. We just, we all come to Pittsburgh and play hockey together. I'm uh, looking forward to most probably, you know, getting on the ice with everyone. We get to play at Heinz Field this year, so that's cool. Playing at Heinz, for sure. Playing with players like Mario and Ty Domi, playing with the pros is the biggest thing I'm looking forward to, for sure. We're going to load up here in about 40 minutes and head over to Heinz Field to watch the uh, outdoor games. Here's Gensel, side of the net, score! It's Crosby! This team victorious over the visitors from Philadelphia, Matt Murray, the winning Today's day two. Uh, just finished up a contract signing, getting to sign a contract. It's here. A bit. Can't beat it. And the Stanley Cup was there, which was unreal. Walked over and there was the cup. It was <laughs> quite a surprise. Mario was great, and uh, having the cup there was uh, a treat. That's the first time I've ever touched the cup, and if I die at lunch, I'll still be happy. Hell of a way to start off the day. We're gonna. Pack it in here and uh, drive out to Cranberry for some practice in our first game. This morning we took a tour of the facility, which is amazing. Let's get started here. Went and saw the private uh, Penguins area. Got into the back where the trophies are. And that's spectacular. And then we uh, got together for a little practice, got the little legs. Everybody's getting the rust out, and some guys play quite a bit. You can tell the guys have played during the year, and some of us don't get to skate as much, and uh, we're sucking wind, so. A and A go. Any questions right now? Just with this first phase. I'm liking our team. I like our team a lot. Team looks good, goalie looks good, but you never know, the puck can bounce one way or the other. This is showtime and really looking forward to it. Oh! Ronnie and Rex are going to run the D, so pay attention to them. Yeah. First game was fun. You know, I got a little tired out there. <laughs> a bit tired. It gets harder to get up and down as you get older, you know. <laughs> but our team was there. They never quit. They kept coming back. They kept matching goal for goal. This year's group is clearly better. Every year, the guys get better and better and better. Uh, the pace was great tonight. This is day three. We're at Heinz Field. It's going to be a spectacular morning. We're going to have the time of our lives. Here we go, guys. Have a great night. This is the 
ultimate highlight. I mean, this is a pretty cool. Why does that happen? Skated outside, but never on a sheet of ice and never on the North Shore. Any player that gets an opportunity to play outside, uh, they love it. They flash back to their past. For me, it brings back memories as a child, just playing hockey outside. But it's still just going out there. Ice is ice, hockey's hockey. It's the campers that make it special for us because of their enthusiasm for not just being around us, but it's just playing with us. We appreciate how much they appreciate us. The, uh, it's all about the charity. Being so close to Mero and Natalie for so many years, I know how much time and work they put into their charity. Every guy that's here knows what he means as far as what he does to help those situations, what he went through himself, and what he brings to the table each and every day. It did touch all of us, and it was great to see everybody watch that skate outside. It was, it, was a, it was a good moment, for sure. He said, you do feel it for the cause, number one. Uh, friendship, number two. But what it's all about is wonderful for everybody. So we got a pretty full day today. We got the morning games, which we just came off of. Exciting 6-5 win. Heading towards the ice and stepping on, you know, Penguins home rink and looking around and taking it all in. Kind of, with not to be too over dramatic, kind of takes your breath away a little bit. We'll have a couple of hours of downtime. We have an autograph session just after lunch. If you didn't know it, you'd get me. Yeah, so today is day four. We're in line to get some autographs from our awesome coaches and captains. And we're signing uh, autographs and uh, bringing stuff. And uh, Mario and Ty and Ron and EJ and Jay and Ron. And everyone's all here signing whatever we bring. Hey, okay, we did the locker room tour. Got to see where they sit. Got to see their gear, all the cool stuff they did. Heating pool, cooling pool, just a whole bunch of stuff that allows them to be at peak physical condition. Yeah, this is probably one of the coolest things I've ever done. It's just a once in a lifetime experience. There's not many things in life that let you be 16 year old again with people like Mario Lemieux. It is beyond incredible. We want to make sure every camper leaves with a, with a, with a great experience and beyond that, a few memories. Maybe it's scoring a goal, maybe it's uh, getting a pass, maybe it's poke checking one of the former pros. I mean, it's just there's something that will bring out uh, a wonderful memory for you and uh, hopefully you make a whole bunch of new friends. Uh, we're heading to our semifinal game. We uh, got all our sillies out this morning. We didn't have a very good game, so we're looking to come back strong. The team we're playing now is the team that we lost to, so we're uh, looking forward for uh, vengeance. Game day, boys.
and welcome back to PPG Paints Arena. It's the championship game in the 2017 Mario Lemieux Fantasy Camp. With the cup on the line, the teams are playing as such. The neutral on and he blisters a shot home, and right off the bat, Team Patrick takes the lead. Right side, and there's a diving pad save. Around the net, looking in front, and there's a shot and a score, and that's Charles Bell. Vasquez with it, and he goes top shelf and scores. A nice shot there by Scott Vasquez. These shots have some authority on them here. It's a slap shot, and Michael Lane has a second goal. Lock it away at the buzzer by Ellis, so. The first period comes to a close, and Team Patrick, a dominating effort there in the opening frame. Shots blocked away, and it's a three on two rush the other way for Team Adams as they try to get on the board. Slap shot off the glove. Second period. Five nothing. Coffee, coffee to Caulfield. Caulfield slap shot in. He scores. Gray now just like that with 6.06 to go. It's 5 2. Gray, he has a second goal. It's 6 to 3. Don't go away just yet. Chance back, Gray, he looks for the hat trick. His slap shot, that goes off the blocker of Ellis. Nice save. And there's a score at the buzzer. That'll make the final score seven to three. Team Patrick, your 2017 Mario Lemieux Fantasy Camp Champions.